combined with like pine tree forests. So and on quite a few of those fights in Lord of the Rings, with a swing of a sword it will go from beech tree to Canadian pine trees. <laughs> and then a swing of another sword and it goes back all of a sudden. So most of the time it was these forests. And we put this here just so you guys can grab a good photo. But the reason it's so big, I mean I know I'm five foot four, but when you put an adult in this chair, I look like a little kid. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So especially those who are taller will look great for you guys. But this goes with the whole force perception cinematography. Now Peter Jackson's first movies, him as a teenager running around, he had no money. So he knew by making big things with people right in front of the camera, they're going to look a lot bigger than people standing far away from the camera. And this was used a lot in Lord of the Rings. For example, one of the first scenes that you have Gandalf, the big tall wizard, and Frodo, the small hobbit, riding on a horse and cart into the Shire. Now you had Gandalf sitting here, Frodo sitting here in the movie, direction when really Gandalf sitting here Frodo sitting all the way at the back of the cart they completely cut the whole side out shot them slightly out of focus and that way you've got the whole big and small in front of the camera and it naturally does it for him instead of all that